before I get into anything else, I want to take a look at what leveling up each of these categories is going to do because I've got it set up for us so we can take a look. Certificate of Acquisition, Toxic Gas. Applies 10 poison to all enemies. Okay, so this is a new type of attack that I can gain now. An artifact, whenever you apply poison, apply one extra poison. That's pretty wild, all right. And then the last one, unlock the world. Laboratory. Now appear during your adventure as a peaceful place to test some recipes before venturing into battle. And we'll do a quick restart and get right back into the action. We've only got one option to start with here. Sort of unusual, usually you have two of them. These guys are going to be a lot easier to handle. In that last video, I made a lot of mistakes that I now understand how not to make. Hopefully, I do a little better here. Unfortunately, there's not a lot of options to guarantee success at the start here. I do have these preset uh, as favorited, but it says they're mastered. They actually aren't mastered. They don't do the mastered damage. If I got really lucky, even then, I don't think there's any way. Well, okay, technically, if I got really lucky, I could hit one of these guys and then double down on it. But yeah, not very likely to happen. I'm better off just shielding myself for the most part and dishing out what little damage I'm able. Now, who do I want to break down first? Probably best to attack this one since these are all both one-hit kills later on anyway. And we'll end the round here. Okay, taking some serious poison, but it's okay as long as I can push through this guy. Which honestly, I almost can, even just as it is. Which is kind of crazy, but since I can't fully, it'd be better to do rock skin to guard against what I can and then use the bomb, get a little bit of their health down, and maybe even do one of these. Throw a miscombination, weaken, else, weaken everybody else on here. Just a bit. They'll try to poison me, they will fail, but I just take a little bit of poison damage uh, there, unfortunately. We're at 94 health, not a big deal. And now I can do enough. Two small bombs is just enough. So let's combine. And so this is kind of a fun part with this first enemy here is I can kill this enemy and the other ones will just follow suit. Really, really convenient. It makes it a little easier to start with. Get a recipe hint. Beetle Bomb, deal four regular damage. Okay, what makes the most sense here? Anti-Venom is probably the most important one to get, I think. So we will grab the hint for it. I think it's fine just to get Anti-Venom's most basic form. I definitely want the poison output to be really strong, but okay, let's go to treasure here. Power Stone. Start each battle with three permanent strength. Really kind of wild. When acquired, your total life is increased by 20. I do like total life, I suppose, but much more interested in the power stone. That seems really, really powerful. Okay, let's go to an event. Sure. Gambler, I just always throw my money at you and you never give me anything, but we'll see. Okay, okay, doubled up our gold. Could be useful. If I go to the shop, I can get some recipes going, which are really useful as you go along because it sucks to just be floundering, not have the recipe. Because you actually can't just memorize, and this was a mistake I made in the last video. I thought I thought you could just memorize, let's say, two bottom ones on, on the Alchemist Fire here, but it actually randomizes it every time. Alchemist Fire, of course, is a little bit simpler to get anyway, but, but it does make it tougher here. We'll do Small Bomb. Hit you with that. Honestly, probably just going to throw poison and a little bit of damage at you. And then end the turn. I'll hold on to this last bit of damage because I might need it later to combine. Okay, you're going to dish out 14 damage. Let's... I can shield 10 of it. Yeah, go ahead and do that. And throw out a bomb. End the turn. I don't have to worry too much about conserving my reagents because they'll just keep refilling themselves as we go here. But it can be nice to do so. Throw this out. Throw this out. Dish out what damage I can. You're going to start powering up. Poison you. <sighs> Crap, I've got so many of these scales. I want to make sure that I draw another one of those pearls just because, or water, whatever they are, just because I, I don't I don't want to miss out on guarding here. Let's see, rock skin potion. I can actually do two rock skin potions. Very good. Is going to be necessary to guard against this damage. Do I throw out the last little bit of damage? I can hold on to this, actually. Uh, just because I want to make sure I get a bomb next time. Here we go. Small bomb. And it'll hit you for a little damage here. End the turn. Okay. Uh, you're going to keep on going. I guess as long as I hold on to that. There's no real reason for me to do anything one way or the other here. You know what? I'll just do like this. Try to guarantee myself a draw. 
I should actually even check the bag. I haven't really thought about doing that. Okay, rock skin potion, super important here. Your health is getting low, but not low enough. Uh, do a bomb, and then I'll poison you as well. Not that it'll do much, but it'll help. Okay, and then, yeah, should be enough just to bomb, and then the poison will finish you off. Ooh, actually, I upgrade my bomb. Nice. So that's enough. After a certain amount of uses, you do get an upgrade for your potions. All right, let's grab some powder, get a recipe hint, poison vial. I think I should be able to find a resting location that'll allow me to get this maxed out immediately, so I'm not going to waste grabbing the hint on it. Instead, let's get the hint for stone skin. I do like the idea of having a better version of the rock wall or whatever you want to call it. Laboratory, that's a new one. Does this, re hopefully this doesn't replace my uh, resting location because I feel like the resting is actually really, really powerful. Uh, okay, I can study recipes as much as I want. Oh wait, oh I have a limited amount. I do have a limited amount, crap, yeah. Okay, that's all right. This doesn't like use them, does it? Okay. Okay, let's see if we can get... Oh, Poison Violet. Oh, I can't test out Poison Violet, but I can test out Anti-Venom. So I want this and this. We'll test this. Doesn't work out for us. Got it. Okay, got Anti-Venom. Excellent. Oh, I do get to test out as much as I want. Really cool. Moves up six poison for myself. Very good. Yeah, I can't tell if I have a limited amount of things or not. Let's see. Poison Vial. So I want... Okay, I do. That, that's that, right? Yeah, I've run out. Okay. Still really useful, though. I got to figure out Antivenom, which is... That's pretty invaluable. Let's get out of here. Let's fight our other enemy. Okay, small bomb. I don't know. I don't want to do small bomb here, but I don't have much choice. I can get rid of the stronger one, though, at the very least. Or maybe I do. Maybe I do. I might have had, actually, a recipe I could use there that maybe could have done more. That seemed like it did high damage. Oh, I've got three permanent strength. I forgot about that. So you know what? We'll hit you, and then we're just going to throw one of these in and hope it kills one. Yes. Okay, nice. Because I think that's a lot better <laughs> of an outcome. Uh, okay. Stone skin. Do I just use rock skin potion? Try to get an upgrade to the rock skin potion. Mastery 7. It's not great, but it's all good. And then... I uh, just throw out this. This should kill. And end turn. Uh, we can do more rock skin potion. Try to get that leveled up. And then just throw this out there. Whack you a little bit. Poison you a little bit. Sure. And turn. Because I, I feel like it's a good idea to try to upgrade Rock Skin Potion before I face the stronger guys. Uh, just keep poisoning you too. <laughs> Why not? I probably could also be testing out how to get the poison uh, anyway. But okay, Rock Skin Potion is leveled up. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about it later. And we'll go for Alchemist Fire. Nope, not that way, and then he's going to die from that anyway. All good, all good. We're testing stuff out. Grab some of these, get a recipe hint. Poison vial, probably a good idea. Ooh, this is really good, though. Bug compound. Get the hint. Excellent. That'll help us a lot later. Ooh, yep, we do get resting circle now. Okay, I was worried I might miss out on it. All right, discover and master one recipe. What do I want to master? Poison vial is what I was thinking about mastering. Let's do it favorite. Continue. Now, I will say having mastered Poison Vial, the advantage of three permanent strength doesn't really apply to it. That's a little bit of a concern, because I'm going to start probably stockpiling reagents here, and it's not really going to be super beneficial to me. The small bomb is going to be a lot more significant for that three permanent strength. So maybe I go to the shop and sell. Mm. Let's skip this person's dialogue. I noticed in the last video, their dialogue seems awfully loud. Okay, so get rid of reagents. I could sell out this, but I think I do want some poison reduction. I know in the second area, I get to have a lot more reagents at once. Do I want to buy recipes or hints for them? Do I already have any recipes here for beetles? Bug compound, two in the bottom, one either here or here. But if I get that wrong, it's gonna be a real big pain. Unfortunately, I don't have an option for that here. Let's buy frag bomb. Sometimes that's really useful. Do I buy a hint for anything here? Maybe buy a hint on exoskeleton. Recipe, buying, buying the recipe outright though isn't that much more expensive. Let's just take the recipe so we can use the beetle for something if we need to. Do I buy hints? Let's buy hint. 
I clicked buy hint, but it gave me the full recipe. Not totally sure what happened there, but let's, uh, I mean, I'm happy with it. We fight the elite before fighting the guardian, because when you fight the guardian, it takes you to a new area. So if I finish off the elite, I'll get a little bit more of an advantage, be able to get some extra reagents before I leave. Obviously, it's a bit of a threat. My health could uh, plummet for it, but okay. We can do rock skin potion, guard the full attack here at the start. Very nice. Uh, do I want to... Hold, I should hold on to one of the scale shards, but I should use one of these. Even though it's a tiny bit of damage, it's still something. The three strength doesn't do anything for it because it's not a potion, but that's okay. So now we can do rock skin. But we can also do one bomb, which is excellent. Get them down a little bit more. That did extra damage. Very cool. End our turn. I want to just always keep holding on to at least one scale shard so that I can... Ooh, do I use it here, though, to block that little extra bit of damage? But I could just also poison vial. Start stacking poison. That's definitely a big deal. Uh, I guess I can still do it. You know, I might. I might. I don't have... I do have one in my drawbag, so I'll guarantee to get a shield here. That's something I didn't use at all in the last game, is taking advantage of knowing what's in my drawbag. Pretty huge thing to ignore <laughs> on my part. Oops, you know. Uh, and then let's do bomb. They don't have any defense, so solid. End the turn. I'll hold on to my scale. Guard again. Yeah, doing really, really well against this elite. They're not really able to get anything in on me. We'll hold on to... A defense for next time. Hit them with one of these. And the turn. Rock skin. Do I have al so alchemist fire? I can try for here. Unlikely that I'll get it, but hey, worth it. Worth a go. Okay, I have one poison on me. It's not a lot, but it's something. We'll rock skin and anti venom. I guess I could. It only saved me the one HP, but I suppose it's worth it. Because I don't have a lot of opportunities to gain health anyway. Okay, I block that. Ooh. Not going to be able to block this, but I will be able to kill. So it's all good. Excellent. Okay, we stay alive. <laughs> Collect pearls. I don't really know what pearls do yet. I, I know they're going to have some effect, but... Elementium. Do I just call this water? But, okay. Total life increased by 20. Fantastic. Wish I could get that poison upgrade I saw at the beginning. Grab the water. Yeah, I'll grab the root because I know I can use it to heal a whole lot, so. And I think I... Did I grab the recipe for the healing already? Yeah, healing salve. Okay. So we'll probably use that on the boss. Let's go for it. Guardian. Archmage Zophorus, the profaner. I, I don't even know what that means. The pro, like profane, like inappropriate. Actually, you know what? I don't even need to use the healing here because I'm pretty sure I get full health once I beat this enemy anyway. So let's just use a bunch of bombs on him. I have three extra strength, so we're going to be dishing out damage. They do get five defense if not shielded and attacked, but that's okay. Dish out what damage I can. And you know what? Heal a little bit as well. Might as well, I suppose. <laughs> it's not that important right now, but whatever. Okay. I think I'm just going to keep on keeping on with the damage output. I could throw in one of these. Just do three more extra damage. But it's not going to do anything against, against that defense. So you know what? Rock skin. It's a little bit excessive, but I'll guard. I probably should have held on to it. Two damage is really nothing. More rock skin? Or do I bomb... I want to get... Let's see, I've got poison in my bag. I want to hold on to... Oh, yeah, I want to hold on to black powder. So I can't really bomb here. So let's let's do a rock skin. And then I'll throw in these. Dish out a tiny bit of damage. End the turn. Guard it. And then poison vial, finally. Awesome. None of this really matters much, so I'll throw these in. End the turn. Hold on to just one so I can guard next turn. I need more poison, though. It's all good. Let's do... Exoskeleton Potion. Try to get rid of some of it. Some of these beetles. That's not going to be fully enough to guard, but it's all good. We'll use these. Do a little bit of hits. And turn. Okay. Did not draw what I wanted to draw there. You know, Bug Compound, though. I know most of it. Let's try for this. If I'm wrong, it's a 50-50. Okay, nice. Okay, awesome. Heal 5 HP. Get rid of some beetles. Very cool. 
And then we just have to end turn and take this damage, but that's okay. I just healed some of it, so it's fine. And as long as I win here, it really doesn't matter. I, I shouldn't be stressing too much. Exoskeleton Potion to get rid of one beetle. And then I can't do enough to, to do anything here, so I'll just hold on to him. End the turn. I need some more poison. <laughs> need more poison. Rock skin. And maybe, maybe dish out the damage. Let's do it. End the turn. Hopefully I draw... Nope, no poison there. That's all good. We're gonna do... I could do Beetle... I could try Beetle Bomb, but the odds are really low. So probably not worth it. I could also try Alchemist Fire, which would almost be enough to end it. Actually, it might even be... That would be enough because of the three extra, right? But just the odds are so low that... I do Alchemist Fire. We know this is a miscombination. I could try two on the bottom. Nope, didn't work out. Uh, yeah, I'll just hit through. Okay. It's not going to be enough to kill, but all good. I can heal. I don't have... Ooh, but I do have enough to heal with Bug Compound. Nice. We'll heal a little bit. Ooh, Bug Compound plus. Yeah, I forgot. It gets really, really strong. Uh, I don't need to favorite it, though, because this guy's going to be gone in a minute. And there's no bugs after this guy that I know of, so no benefit to that. Maybe I should have saved it just in case. I don't know. And I'll just heal. End the turn. So just one more hit on them is enough. Just hopefully don't have too many beetles here. Okay, yeah. I don't want to do poison. I want to do damage. I guess I have to do poison, don't I? Yeah, I don't have enough. Uh, beetle bomb would be enough, I guess. Or do I just poison? Do I just poison? Might be the only way to actually kill here. Beetle Bomb would do four. Yeah, it wouldn't be enough. We're gonna do poison. Because I can't really shield much. Poison vial. Let's do it. And then shield for what I can. Ooh, exoskeleton potion though. Actually, we can do that. Never mind. Boom, boom. There's four shield. And then the extra two. Six shield, and we get a hit in, and then they die. Okay, solid. And then we go to the new area where we will fully recover. Artifact. When added, three cracked skull. Okay, we'll take it. Get the pearls. Whatever they do. Do I grab up all these? There's so many here. That's kind of spooky. But I think it's a maybe. That's kind of rough. And then thorn skin tonic. 15 retaliate. I don't know what that does yet, but I think... It's probably like whatever I get hit for, I do equivalent back. For all of these, though, the odds of me actually finding it are low. Well, except for this one, Feebleness Gas. Okay, so this one I'll take because there's a really high chance I actually get that. And then we have our first enemy. The enemies out here are really strong. Kind of scared for that. Ugh, yeah, this guy's really, really tough. Definitely intimidating. I could do Feebleness Gas, but we'll probably keep with Rock Skin Potions. I wish I could, like, double master or something. And then we're going to try... Oh, yeah, Feebleness Gas. I don't... I guess I don't have enough for... No, I have enough. Why is it saying I can't make this? Oh, oh, it doesn't substitute for, for something too stronger than it, just by one. Okay, that makes sense. Then, uh, yeah, we're just going to throw the Weakens in there. There we go. Nice. I shield all of that damage. Look at how much health I have. Very cool. I'd like to poison if I can. Yeah, Poison Vial. Is that going to work? And then I do have Healing Self as well. We're going to poison this guy. Because I think if, if this one dies, do these ones also die? I'm assuming. So we'll poison you. And then we're also going to rock skin. And then we'll hold on to what I need for healing, but we're going to weaken somebody. Okay, end the turn. Taking some big hits here. But I'll hold on a little bit longer. Well, 25? Yeah, it's not enough yet. But I will use uh, healing salve in a minute here. We can do one rock skin... And then I have enough for healing self. Not going to use it yet. Just going to use. Oh, wait. Healing self. Oh, but it does require some of these. So I'm going to hold on to these two. And then dish out this damage. You do a lot. All right. Guard against what I can. Then use healing self. Heal HP. It's huge. Rock skin. Guard some. And. I'm going to just heal a little bit more, I guess. <laughs> End the turn. Ugh. So much damage. I can do two rock bombs, but that's not going to be enough to really do anything much. Ugh, they have so much attack. Oh, when this character takes damage, it gains eight permanent strength. I mean, they have weaken on them at least. That's why they're not doing 32 damage. Okay, got it. So I want to only hit them when I can kill them. Maybe I kill one of these then. 
I can do 33 damage here with small bombs. This is this is uh, spooky. It's nearly enough to kill this guy. Yeah, maybe I do need to kill these guys first next time. Oh, actually I have permanent, yeah, I have permanent strength. Oh, when these guys die, they hurt me. Uh, if I can survive here, this is the, this will be the first I've ever gotten though. We're gonna weaken somebody, nice. And try to heal a little bit, and that'll be it. Taking a lot of hits, a lot of hurt. Oh, 28 times three, yeesh. And then I guess I'll small bomb this guy. Uh, it's just so much damage. Oh, when this guy's taking poison damage, <laughs> his strength is going up. Yeah, I don't have enough poison to justify the amount of damage I'm giving this guy. So end the turn, take the damage. If I can just survive long enough. <laughs> uh, just more Roxian potions, that's all I can do. Fortunately, I think I'm just going to lose here. More poison, more poison, that's what you get throughout these. Let's see how much damage this guy's going to do here. 54 times 3. Oh, but I have a better understanding now. I think it's possible I could beat them out next time, especially if I can get more poison. I think poison is really important in this game. We're going to go one more time in this video, but first, let's try to unlock the world more. What are you going to give me? Okay, max out, unlock the world. Reagent Smith. A mysterious figure can now appear on your journeys. Be on the lookout for the Reagent Smith. He's mad in love with pearls. Okay, we finally get to figure out what that is. Uh, I guess artifacts. Post them into that. Try again here. Pearls must be huge because you don't get a lot of them. Let's go here. Who do we have? Okay, big guy to start with. So we want to be throwing out some damage because, uh, let's see. My odds, I'm definitely going to get at least one pearl next time, I think. Or, or I'm really likely to, so I'll just throw it all out like that. And then we can shield this turn. Double shield it. Hold on to the black salt, I think. No, we're going to get black salt for sure, so we'll throw it out. End turn. Okay... Small bomb. And they'll throw out this, and I'll hold on. I'll just hold on to him. I guess I could just... Oh, yeah, I guess I could guarantee myself by just using everything that I have. I don't know, whatever. Small bomb. I know I'm going to draw it, so just use it all. And turn. Okay, actually, no, yeah, that didn't make a lot of sense what I was doing there. <laughs> Uh, hit you with some damage. I'm gonna guard a decent chunk of this. But it took nine damage. Okay. Bomb you. End the turn. And I'll use this to shield me most of the way up. End the turn. And then hopefully, yep, draw two of these. We'll hit you with a lot. Boom. Okay, yeah, just keep hitting them. This should be enough to kill. Maybe I can even... Can I even upgrade? Uh, nope, not quite. Not enough to upgrade my small bomb, but I'm getting there. Grab these. Recipe hints. What makes sense here? It's gonna be based off, really, the shop. So, I know I'm gonna get poison vial no matter what. So, we'll just get a hint for frag bomb, I guess. Okay, let's go to the shop. See what they've got. Weirdly, shop is actually really pretty good. I didn't think it was very good initially, but... Because you can buy recipes, that's pretty crazy. Healing salve, do I buy a hint for that? Bug compound is crazy, though. Need that. We'll buy it. And then also anti-venom. We'll buy this recipe. That's all I can afford for now. I might get rid of things at some point, but I'm just not confident that I can lose anything. I guess I really... I guess I could, though, just have, like, four items. But the problem is when, that, when I fight that bug guy, they're gonna make it really tough on me. Although, I guess I do have the recipe now to fight the bug guy. So if I just... If I just had enough to attack with... I don't know. I need enough to shield with, and I need enough to dish out damage with or poison with. So we'll think about it. We'll think about it. I'll come back to it. Get the resting circle. We're gonna discover a recipe. Probably gonna take poison vial. Would also not be a bad thing to get um, the stone skin potion, but I don't. I haven't seen it yet. So yeah, we'll just take poison vial. Poison vial is probably my favorite. Find another enemy. I know this one should be the crab guy, right? Oh, it's the three little crab guys. Yeah. Oh, didn't draw anything, but I can do my eleven damage. Nice. Uh, do it to. This one, and then it's more important to get them down now, so I take less damage. I'm gonna take take a pretty decent hit here, though. And turn. I'm gonna shield myself from a decent amount of the damage here, and then you know I guess I could have killed one of them, but yeah, whatever. Small bomb. Okay. And turn. I think what I'll do here is double shield. And 
then dish out a little damage to each of them. Because I want to I wanna make sure I kill this one and shield this one this next turn. So that I can, from there... I, I want to make sure that my uh, rock skin is maxed out. I'm going to try to get recipes, grind recipes off these guys. Is my plan. Okay, I didn't... Oh, crap. I didn't get any defense here. Maybe I have to kill this guy now. Yeah. It's not worth taking the damage. Is the problem here. Let's just do it. I wanted to grind out some potions, but I don't want to take any damage for it. Let's grab this. Recipe hint. Stone skin potion recipe hint or thunderstone. Let's take thunderstone. I like just 20 base damage. It makes sense, I think. Laboratory. Let's do... Let's try to discover a new recipe. Stone skin potion is a maybe. Let's do thunderstone first. So I know thunderstone is two and one. Let's do this. Not that one, which means it has to be this one. This might even be a waste. Maybe I shouldn't even discover it fully. I should just test and see what it's going to be. And now I have Thunderstone. Frag Bomb. Yeah, let's try that one out. Combine. So, black bottom, black top left, blue top right is not correct. So I'm just going to remember for Frag Bomb, it's going to be like this. That way I don't have to waste any more of my attempts. Test the different combinations. Okay, none of those are combinations that work for stone skin. All good, so we have run out, but now I know what frag bomb is, and I think I learned thunderstone there, right? Let's head to another enemy. All right, so I want to guard a hit here, and I want to dish out a little damage here. And there we go. We've got rock skin potion mastered. Awesome. Let's learn frag bomb right now. Very cool. So we've got black, black, blue. Combine. Get frag bomb, right? Awesome. Seven damage twice. <laughs> End the turn. And I can actually... I can kind of grind off this guy then. Let's do... So I don't know what stone skin is going to be necessarily, but I know a lot of the miss combinations. And I think I've got enough here to nearly guard fully this. So let's try out stone skin if I can get it. Didn't quite get it. Okay. Maybe do frag bomb. That's not going to be enough though, is it? Not quite enough, but I can just kill after. So let's... Let, yeah, let's use frag bomb. That way we can start mastering frag bomb more. And then just throw a bomb at him. Okay. I think I'm getting better. I think this makes sense as a way to do it. Let's grab this. Get a recipe hint. What here makes sense? Healing salves? A maybe. Beetle bomb is probably because I need I need to learn beetles. Or alchemist fire. I do like alchemist fire. That would be kind of free. Let's take alchemist fire. This is a risk. This is a risk because I need to make sure I can kill the guardian. Get the treasure. Nice. Each battle with 10 shield. But it's, it's temporary shield. It's not permanent. Or three Noxious Essence. I think Noxious Essence, getting this satchel is super important. Even though I, I mean, I kind of like the idea of this, it, it helps guarantee that I don't take some initial damage because sometimes you just only draw attack. But yeah, let's take Noxious Essence. Go to Invent. Uh, I don't have anything for you, buddy. Let's just do the five coins. Okay, sure. Yeah, <laughs> that'll work. Now we've unlocked the Guardian, correct? So let's fight the Elite first. See if I can get a little stronger off them first. Guard. Guard again. Boom. Okay, 65 HP isn't a ton, but it's all good. Let's take the pearls. Total life increased by 20, and we'll grab these. I think I need Beetle Bomb, actually. Because I don't really have any way of, of tossing out the beetles. Okay, a little bit rough. So I want to start putting on poison, definitely more than anything. And we're just going to heal and dish out damage. I've got a good chance of redrawing uh, the water there, so not going to worry too much about it. End the turn. I want to poison you like crazy if I can, but... Okay. Small bomb, Alchemist Fire. Okay, we know Alchemist Fire is this way now. So let's hit him with the 10 Pierce. Nice. And nothing else I can really do. Be a kind of a waste to throw these out, wouldn't it? I don't want to... I don't want him loading up my deck, though. That is kind of a problem. So let's... Let's throw one at him. Let's throw two. Push down their defense as low as possible. I think I probably should guard here. Do we try to... Try to learn Stone Skin? Man, I, the odds of getting of, of getting what I want here are pretty low. Nothing else here, so... The chances are that I'm going to get a lot of poison, honestly, though. So let's just use this one, because I want to make sure I have enough to shield next time if I need to. Actually, I, sh I shouldn't need to, though, because you're going to keep keep powering up your strength, so... Okay, uh, then poison vial for sure. Do I try stone scene potion more? Odds are low. So instead, use this, I guess? I don't know. Try to give myself the best odds I can for uh, more poison. And then we do rock skin potion. And uh, just poison you a little bit more. Sure. Guard it. Now we should have enough for beetle bomb. Try like this. Ah, unlucky. Okay, but I can try. Uh, I don't want to try that. No, no way. 
Roxine Potion. End turn. Okay, nothing really here for me. Just poison you a bunch. 20 poison, you die. Easy enough. Okay, not a bad fight, not a bad fight at all. And we get up to 200 health this next time. Collect pearls, artifact, three horn fragments, I suppose. I really don't know about Cracked Skull. I don't think it's very good, genuinely. I don't think it's worth it. More of these? So many of them. This is kind of rough. Bottle of Lightning, 42 regular damage. Let's take it. Yeah, pretty good odds of getting that right. They're really good odds, actually. I just need the water in the right position. Which one of these guys? I mean, I think it's random anyway. Which of the two I'm going to get? Do we get Golem? Yes, we do. Unfortunate, but this time, killing these guys. Leave this guy weak. Can I kill you in one go? That'd be cool, but I don't think so. Rock skin, then. I could try for stone skin, actually. Pretty good odds. They have a lot of miscalculations, right? For some reason, all my... Uh, all my tests are gone now. Okay, don't love that. Then yeah, we're just gonna do rock skin. Ooh, wish I used it with the other one though. I wish it would just automatically use the weakest substitute, but I think it goes based off of what the uh, technical choice is. Heal a little bit. Don't wanna dish damage out to everybody, so instead I'm gonna amp up my strength. End turn. What are my choices here? 10 piercing damage? Nah, I think I really do need to just, just shield more than anything. Even shield a little bit more, that'll shield me from most of it. And then I wanna poison this one. I, I, I don't want to hurt this guy at all. He's crazy. And then... Ooh, I can poison you again. Very cool. Love that. End turn. That should give me enough leeway to hopefully kill this turn. Okay, no way of shielding. This is a little rough. Okay. Healing salve, I would love to, but I'd have no testing of it yet. 11 times 2, 22. That, that'd be enough. Yeah, I have enough to kill. Okay, gotta kill here. I mean, I have... Oh, no temporary strength. Okay. Good. Take the damage, that's okay. Heal. It's not much, but it's something. Temporary strength. I, I can't afford to poison the wrong one here, so leave it at that. What do I have? Poison vial? I think so. Nine damage, or I could just do 11 flat. Yeah, we'll poison you. I wish I got, I need I need some shielding now. Okay, maybe, maybe going to the shop would be a good idea at some point. Give myself more temporary strength and just end the turn. This is real rough. Okay. Oh gosh, I'm not I'm not gaining what I need. I don't know if this is a lack of luck. No, it's just because I keep putting these into my deck. Dangerous way to live. And I can't do the healing salve. It's just too risky. I can't afford to use any of these. Uh, okay. Just gotta hope for some luck here. And I didn't get it. Yeah, I, I backed myself into a corner here. Just gonna have to hope it hits the right guy. It didn't. Okay, but one hit isn't as bad as it could be, I guess. And we just have to hope I get something. Something else. Okay, one hit again. Hit the right guy. Thank you. Do it again. Would it be enough to kill? Almost. Okay, one more time. Wrong. One more time. Yes, it was enough. It was enough. Now I'm gonna take a lot of damage, but it's okay. 20 regular damage, one hit. That's a good sacrifice to make, I think. It's kind of kind of nuts though, but okay. Heal a little bit, end the turn. Please give me shield. I have four, okay. Oh, is this gonna kill me outright? I feel unlucky here. Am I am I wrong to feel unlucky? That, that feels like it just went all wrong. Take this. Okay. Way too much water as it is. It's just not worth it to have that many. New enemy types. It's not telling me any effects, though. This character returns five regular damage each time it is attacked. So do I want to kill this one first or kill these first? I really don't know. Preparing something. This game does not play around. Uh, recipes. 20 damage target enemy. But honestly, I need to shield myself so badly. Unless I can just kill one outright. Maybe I can. Now, we're going to do... We're gonna shield, and then we're going to buff, if I can. Yes, it worked, okay. Eight buff, and then we're going to do, ooh, do I do 20 this way? They're gonna hit me more, but I have eight buffs, so I should do eight extra damage per attack, right? So instead of doing 28, I could do 36. That's almost enough to kill, so I think that makes sense. Oh, it's only it's it's not it's not, it's not as strong as I thought. So it's not eight and eight. It's just eight the first time. Okay. Well, either way, I guess it's still more damage overall. I think. Well, no, it's the same amount of damage either way. So stone skin potion is the one to go for here. Well, I could I could get twenty four instead though. I think I'd rather go the twenty four partially also because it uses up more of the water essentially. Eight temporary buff though is is also a thing. Let's do this. That way I can hold on to some of my defense. Eight, eight buff, we heal a little bit, poison a little bit, we end the turn. Wait, does this... 
Does this count as being attacked? It doesn't. That's actually something I should have thought about. Do I, do I healing salve here? I think so. I think maybe. I'll wait till later to healing salve. You're just preparing forever until I hit you, I think. Which is good for me. Unless you're going to summon more. And strength tonic. And then I don't think I want to use these poisons because if this guy gets hit, he might start going crazy. So I'll hold on to the poison, but I'll heal a little bit. And the turn. Hopefully I can get something to use to poison here. Not quite. Nope. Okay, temporary strength up. When I can, I'm just gonna hit I'm gonna hit this guy enough to kill, I think. And the turn, take a lot of hit here. Okay, you're gonna start attacking now. Got it. Okay. So what do I wanna do? I wanna poison vial probably. Anything else though that makes sense? There's also lesser strength or small bomb. Poison vial will be enough to kill this one. Then we're definitely just gonna rock skin or no, we're gonna stone skin. Stone skin. And then a little more temporary strength and the turn. Ouch, that hurts. I've got 34 extra, which means if I do this, it's gonna do, instead of doing 11, it's gonna add 34, which is enough to kill outright. Excellent. You're gone. And now though, we do have a bit of a problem. We're gonna, we're gonna poison value. We're gonna add extra poison. And we're gonna defend a little bit. Just do everything we can here. To reduce what's coming and turn see if i can heal yeah i can heal healing salve excellent go for 25 i wish you could I, honestly now i wish i had weaken a little bit but see i've got 60 health you're gonna do half of it is there any way that i can just push enough to kill you i guess it depends on what i draw next huh yeah this will be enough to kill me unless I shield, so I will be shielding most likely, unless there's a way to kill. So, 77, yeah, I'm gonna have to shield. Look at what I have, though. I'll shield 12 of it, I'll poison vial, maybe small bomb makes more sense so I can keep filtering out the water. Either way, rock skin potion for sure. Yeah, I think then small bomb, and then I'm gonna, I'm just gonna hit you with poison more directly. Oh, I should have done the temporary strength as well, didn't think about that. And then, yeah, strength tonic for next time. And turn nearly kills me. So I have to kill here, because like there's no way to defend 27 with only seven health. Strength, strength, small bomb, enough to kill? Don't think so. <laughs> Nearly, heal, poison. I mean, it's gonna be enough to get you so close to death, but no, it doesn't happen. Let's unlock another artifact. All maps are revealed. What does that mean? And then unlock recipe. Oh, I think I know what that means. Okay, so now if I go to quick restart, it's just gonna show me everything, right? Or no, that's, uh, that's if I get the artifact. Okay, got it. All right, well, that is where I'm gonna leave this video. If you do enjoy the game, wanna see more of it, let me know in the comments. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more videos like this, and I will see you in the next one. Bye now.